Hey guys, if you are struggling like crazy with your restaurant because of the coronavirus, no one's coming in, make sure you guys watch this video because I'm gonna be sharing with you the number one way you can survive. Hey, it's Wilson here. Today we're gonna do an updated version of this video when we talked about the coronavirus and the impact on the restaurant industry and how you can survive. That was before the government had us shut down our restaurants. But now, since we're in the midst of being quarantined, in the midst of closing everything down, how can we survive that? That's what we're gonna dive into right now. We're running in the slimmest margin, so anything that we can do right now can definitely help. If you guys want to learn more about how do you guys build a successful restaurant, how do you even like strategies in growing your restaurant, so on and so forth, make sure you subscribe along the journey. So without further ado, let's dive right in. The first way that you can survive this pandemic is to create a delivery only menu. And what that means is because we're sanctioned to close off our restaurants, the only way we can still do business is to operate as delivery only business. Now, a lot of the restaurant items that we have, a lot of them are not delivery friendly. And what I mean by that is, for example, French fries, after it gets delivered, 30 minutes from the moment it gets in the box, it becomes all soggy and it's not good, which is the reason why we need to create a menu item that is still amazingly good and the quality is still gonna be there for your customers. Second, if you're already not on these third-party delivery sites, make sure that you guys are on there, make sure that you guys are subscribed with them, make sure that you guys subscribe with like, let's say Postmates, Uber Eats, Skip to Dishes, Grubhub, any of these delivery service apps, you need to sign up with them ASAP. If you don't know how to, and if you want to learn more about that, make sure you guys check out this video right here. Third is to have your own delivery system and to waive all the delivery charges because, why are we saying that? Because with signing up on these third-party apps, it's gonna take weeks. So what can you do at the same time? You, if you can't do anything, it doesn't mean you stop doing anything and just sit down on the couch and just cry yourself and grieve. No, you don't wanna do that. You're gonna take things into your own hands and take action, which is why I've advised all my mentees and all the restaurants that I work with to have their own delivery system free of charge. So then that way, people can still order from your restaurant and enjoy your meal. Fourth is to utilize your social media and your email list, okay? A lot of people are underutilizing these platforms, underutilizing it because they feel like that they have nothing to share, they are not really, you know, keeping people engaged and they just have an email list but they don't know what to do with it. Now's the time to use it. Now's the time to tell the people out there what you're up to. Share with them your delivery only menu. Share with them the fact that you have free delivery and that itself would be able to spike the different traffic coming into your restaurant to keep you sustained and keep you alive. Bonus one that I'm gonna share with you is to have gift cards available because know the one thing that communities know that restaurant owners are suffering. They know the fact that they're running on slim margins, which is the reason why they would want to support local businesses. So what that means is have gift cards available, gift certificates available, and go out there and ask people. Put it on your social media and ask people, hey, you know what? We're gonna be selling $100 gift cards at a price of $80. If you guys wanna support us to make sure that you know we're still around after this whole virus blows by, you can buy this gift card right now, come in for an amazing meal after the fact. This has proven to be super effective for the people that have a community, for the people that have loyal fans. So if that's you, make sure that you start implementing the gift card system and discounting it that way you have enough cash flow to sustain the months that you're gonna be out of business. So there you go. These are the ways, the most updated ways for you to be able to combat the coronavirus. So then that way you can stay afloat. So then that way you can live another day to fight another day. I'm here with you along the journey, which is the reason why I am doing a lot more videos like this to help you along the way to survive. Because once again, I understand how difficult it is for us to run on such slim margins. If you guys have any questions and things that you want me to cover, leave it in the comment section below and I'll make sure to reply to you guys to help you guys, guys out any way, shape, or form. Otherwise, make sure you guys subscribe along the journey. And you know what? Smash the like button. I'll see you guys in the next video.